Okay, first off, we want to calm fears. This after law enforcement and school districts across the state posted a warning from the FBI about a possible threat of school shootings tomorrow. The FBI has not been able to confirm that threat as credible. But now a fake post listing specific schools is spreading like wildfire on social media. The fake post has parents scrambling and schools making adjustments. And tonight, TSP 11 store in Howington puts rumors to rest. And so Sunday, the FBI alerted law enforcement agencies and schools across the state about a potential school shooting in Arkansas tomorrow. It was meant for general awareness. There was no specific uh, threat, but today a fake post circulated on social media naming two schools uh, that the threat targets. The claims are not real, but parents and schools are still taking it very seriously. Earlier this week, police departments and schools across Arkansas took to social media to alert people of a viral threat about a possible school shooting Thursday. There was no confirmation it was true. It's sad. It's sad. But this new yet fake post pretending to be from a local news station circulated on social media Wednesday naming two specific schools. And today escalated to being scared to go to school tomorrow. Chris McKenzie has three kids in the Little Rock School District. She received the general awareness alert from LRSD earlier this week. And her kids have heard about the threat throughout school hallways. One had a very difficult time getting out of the car this morning. McKenzie's middle child attends Pulaski Heights Middle School here and although that social Social media post doesn't have any credibility. She says she's not taking any chances. I think their schools are safe um, and I want them to go to school tomorrow. As a parent, you know, you've decided to keep your kids home from school. Um, you felt like you made the best choice there. Yes. McKenzie is one of many parents who are choosing to keep their kids home Thursday. I've reached out to several districts about the attendance policy. The Pulaski County Special School District did respond. The district is making adjustments for Thursday. It's giving students an excused absence. If students bring a parent note Friday stating they missed because they were scared of the shooting threat. For McKenzie, she's unaware if LRSD will make any changes to its attendance policy, but feels confident in her decision to keep her kids home. I would be devastated if something happened to them. Again, we do want to clarify that the post linking schools to the threat is fake. There's no credibility to it. However, schools across the state do not take any threat lightly. They are prepared and have measures in place.